What color is the center line and goal line on a professional hockey rink? Uh, blue. What is the name for a group of stars named after a real or mythological person or creature or inanimate object? Pass. What was the name of the gladiator school of the gladiator that dropped out of school and led a slave revolt in 73 BC? Oh, God. Uh, the Coliseum, I don't know. Next. Which, which capital city touches two continents? One more time. Which capital city touches two continents? Um, Vancouver, I don't know. What writer is sometimes known as the Bard? What writer? Yes, what writer is sometimes known as the Bard? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. What is the name of a group of stars named after a real or mythological person or creature or an inanimate object? Constellation. Constellation. Time. All right, Jake. How do you feel? Terrible. You guys make me feel dumb. Okay. <laughs> That's, that's always our goal. Uh-huh. <laughs> All right, Jake. We make us on. feel dumb, too. Don't feel bad. Alex makes his way in. Does he? I only gave him a head nod. I didn't wave, and it threw him off. Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't I quite know. sure if that was a purposeful head nod or, <laughs> no, <laughs> or like yeah. you were just responding uh, to something he had said. That was a mixed message you received. It's on me. Sorry about that. No All worries. right, his score is recorded. He is on. <laughs> he is on hold. Hot Wings, it's your turn. Okay. Trying to start a new win streak. All Jackpot's right. Jackpot's one hundred dollars. <laughs> I feel like the pressure's pretty <laughs> low today. Me. Don't look at it, Hot Wings. No, I'm not, else I won't. I won't. I want. I want to. Because anytime people are reading things and they want to see something, it makes me want to see it. But Hot Wings. That's a good more like. <laughs> it is. Uh, all right. Hot Wings, your turn. Yeah. Begins in three, two, one. What color is the center line and goal line on a professional hockey rink? Uh, blue. What is the name for a group of stars named after a real or mythological person or creature or an inanimate object? Oh my gosh, what? Again? What is the name for a group of stars named after a real or mythological person or creature or an inanimate object? Oh, a constellation. What was the name of the gladiator who dropped out of school and uh, dropped out of gladiator school and led a slave revolt in 73 BC? Oh my gosh. Um pass. Which capital city touches two continents? Um, Moscow. What writer is sometimes known as the Bard? Uh, Shakespeare. What was the name of the gladiator school dropout who led a slave revolt in 73 BC? Um, oh boy. Tiberius. Time. How do you feel, Howings? I think I'm going to know that one when I hear it. Otherwise, I think I did okay. Okay. feel all right. Jake. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back. <clears throat> A text came in after you finished, <laughs> and it said, Jake from State Farm, more like Jake from Dumb Farm. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Sorry, Jake. <laughs> The rest Actually, were very Joshua positive. Oh, <laughs> yeah, this one. Jake, they didn't make you feel dumb. You just realized how dumb you are. Something tells yeah, me I wish no. I had played it... Jake yesterday. All right, here we go. <laughs> what color is the center line and goal line on a professional hockey rank? Hot Wings said blue. Jake said blue. The answer is red. It is red, yeah. As soon as I said uh, I'm like, no, the blue line's somewhere blue else. Line's <laughs> blue line's yeah. blue. Yeah. Blue line's blue. Yeah. What is the name for a group of stars named after a real or a mythological person or creature or an inanimate object? Hot Wings said constellation. Jake said constellation. Tied at one. What was the name of the gladiator school dropout who led a slave revolt 
in 73 BC. Howing said Tiberius. Jake went with Colosseum, the well-known gladiator building. I assume that's as good as my answer. The answer is Spartacus. Spartacus, of course. Spartacus. Well, I am Spartacus. I could not come up with it. What capital city touches two continents? Hot Wings said Moscow. Jake went with Vancouver. Hmm. Not a capital. Nor does it touch two continents. Or competence. It doesn't. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's quite, quite an a, incontinent. It's an it is. Quite a ways away from anything other than the one it's on. The answer is Istanbul. Istanbul. But not Constantinople? Not con- Correct. Not Constantinople. Tied at one, we go to the last question. Wow, okay. Hot Wings well, versus Jake from Dumb Farm. He was stupid because we're tied. I think it was the Coliseum answer. Uh, maybe. What writer is sometimes known as the Bard? Hot Wings said Shakespeare. Jake did not answer. Shakespeare is correct, and Hot Wings wins. Two to one. Uh, At least I'm uh, on par with you somewhat. You only got two. If that wasn't a washout. Yeah, I got exactly twice as many as you. (laughs) That's a very optimistic way of looking at getting a two. Yeah, yeah. if I got 100, you'd only get 50. That's terrible. I got an A, you got an E. <laughs> he smashed you good, Jake. Yeah, I just After used the game. math against you. All, All right, right no, Jake. I'm... Thanks for playing. Thanks for listening. Thanks for having me. Bye, bud. No, hardly, hardly lighting the world on fire. I, this is hard not, not been a great week for me, really. I mean, I know I won Monday and Tuesday, but even those were barely and didn't feel great. Derp, derp. Derp. <laughs>